Yeah. So Julian Assange's reaction to the talk? Um, I just feel really lucky to have seen it. I think it was it's an amazing experience and I feel very lucky to be part of a worldwide phenomenon really. And um, I was pretty surprised to see two or three people escorted out of the talk. It kind of reminded me what a dramatic situation I was in. But um, no, I feel really lucky, really exciting. Do you think, I thought it was really interesting. I'm a bit disappointed that it wasn't more controversial, but obviously it's going to be a bit more um, politically correct, especially considering the trial and things, the certain things you can't really address. Yeah. Anything you disagreed with? For me, the most striking thing about him is his confidence. His confidence. I mean, you don't go through that much shit from that many governments and that many people without really believing in the cause. Um, or about him. I, 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 th I found his, his remarks at the end uh, about how uh, there should effectively be, effectively be with with all state, um, all, all state policy and discussion, that there should be no real private correspondence, but that it should be some kind of public discourse, uh, where you know, where, where n nothing is too dangerous to be held back. Um, I, I thought was I, I thought was uh, you know remarkable. Uh, that, that, he, that he holds that what, what was the best thing about the talk for you? I thought some of the questions were really, really good. I mean, it's always, uh, sort of, asking a speaker a question is always quite an intimidating thing, but to ask Julian Assange a question, it, particularly, and I thought some of them were brilliant, and you could sort of see his lawyers kind of going, and so um, that, was quite, that was quite exciting. But right, yeah, no, I think that's the problem, because one person, or at least one very, very small organisation, with a lot of information on their hands. Hmm. But I appreciate his honesty about the fact that you can't get away from the fact that there will always be some bias. Yes. Yeah. He, he did. He was very honest. Yeah. 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 So, you, know, you know, we have personal biases just like anyone else does. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Uh, there's so much to talk about with him. If you had one question to ask him, what would it be? To be honest, I think it would have been the one that um, the last girl asked, like, is there anything too dangerous to... I mean, that was a brilliant question. When she asked that, I was like... <laughs> If you had one question you could ask him, what would it be? Um, it was, what is your government ideal? Okay. I mean, because it seems to be that he just wants an open conversation where everyone knows everything. Yeah. Um, but, you know, I, I find it hard to imagine how that could be included. I'd ask him if there was one thing you could tell us that without any consequences on his behalf. Okay. Like risk of arrest or anything. There was something he could tell us. What would it be? Yeah.